Um, one of the moments uh, that sort of stood out to me um, was interesting because it was from a talk from someone I actually know personally somewhat well. We overlapped uh, in, in, our, in my postdoc uh, from uh, the talk from Guillermina Ramirez San Juan. Um, it was, you know, I've had a bunch of scientific conversations with her um, over the years, uh, but it, I found out in her talk for the first time that we had uh, somewhat similar early trajectories into biophysics, uh, namely that we started out with this interest in uh, more in philosophy and literature. And then there was a moment, a transitional moment where, you know, we both encountered um, mathematics and in particular, the, the uh, beauty of the logical structure of proofs. And that sort of switched us into these more sort of quantitative disciplines and led to physics. Um, and I just found that sort of interesting to learn a new thing about someone who I already I kind of knew um, and to find that that uh, additional point of similarity, because I think now we've uh, ended up with somewhat similar scientific interests, uh, you know, very far down the road. So that was fun. Um, and then another one uh, that, that also sort of stood out to me, um, it was a couple little moments, um, but in uh, Maha's talk. And so Maha is someone I have, you know, had the wonderful opportunity to work with. And uh, in, in, you know, uh, sort of professional scientific uh, context, I encounter him as this, you know, very quick thinker, this incisive mind. And so science just seems so natural and easy for him. But to hear him uh, talk about his scientific trajectory in terms of failures that he experienced and having difficulty sort of finding his way uh, uh, was sort of shifted my perspective a little bit. It wasn't necessarily something I would expect to come from him. And I really loved this one moment um, where he described the learning process as, um, imitating things that we find uh, you know, good and interesting. And that some, at some point there's this transition in that process where we, we become creative. Um, and uh, to hear someone articulate having gone through that experience, someone that who I see as very creative um, was sort of inspiring uh, to think that you know, uh, we, this is something that we can all, a process that we can all go through uh, uh, and hope to achieve something uh, great as a result as well.